hello what up guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's your boy famous nelson and today i want to teach you guys how to download and use free vocal presets in fl studio mobile in my last video i dropped some links to my uh, presets to some vocal presets which i made on fl studio mobile i made them for those of you that are using fl studio mobile but most of you don't know how to install them and many of you don't even know how to use them so today i just want to show you guys how to do it so first let me show you how to download free vocal presets let's go to youtube just waiting for the youtube app to load and when it loads, you go to your search bar Let's search for free Effort Studio Mobile Free Vocal Presets. So click on search and you scroll down. You see the first video here free vocal presets for Effort Studio Mobile. You click on it. Good. So you don't have to miss Make your Make sure you like the video. Anymore. Don't forget don't you... to like the video. That's one important thing you must always do. Most times you guys come across my content, you watch, you don't comment, you don't like, and that's not really encouraging. So whenever you come across my videos, please watch them. So you just go to the link in the description of the video and it will take you here. And you see download and you click on download. You wait for it to download, you click download. So I'm through downloading it, don't open it. Just close the um, app and go back to FL Studio Mobile. So now we are through with how to download. Let me show you how to install it now. When you come to FL Studio Mobile, all you got to do is to click on the Apple icon at the top right side of your screen. Then you click on Import. So you just click on This Week. So you scroll down. So you see it here, the free vocal preset we just downloaded. So all you got to do is just click on it. Then it says import 20 files. You click on yes. Then you click on um, delete. So now you've successfully installed them into FL Studio Mobile. Let me show you where you can actually find them in FL Studio Mobile. You click on the Apple icon at the right side of your screen. Then you click on back. And you click on my rakes you see them on my rack i don't know if it's racks or rake i don't know how to pronounce them so these are the sample um the presets we just installed now pay attention let me show you how you can use them the rest part of this video contains very important information so please make sure you don't skip any part otherwise you mix very important information so let's just see this is the raw vocals let's just listen to it and see how it sounds so this is the raw vocals right and this is how it sounds without the preset so now let's just say you want to add one of the presets to it all you got to do is to click on this icon here then you click on the plus icon then you click on rec presets then you click on my files then you come down to my rec and so these are the presets you've downloaded so you can actually pick any of them and use so before you add a preset to your vocals make sure the vocal is playing now so let's just turn it on mm. so let's go back my, I click on my files my you can just keep testing them to see how each one of them sound so you can hear how all of them sound different. So let's just go down. You see the different ones. The different all of them sound different way. So let's just see. If, okay, I think this one is much more better for this voice. So let's just say you have a preset and it's not sounding the way you really want it to be. You can actually make some little adjustment. You know. Uh, let's just. So for this preset, I think the reverb is too much, so I would have to turn down the reverb.
Na ukina chanta kufa na pressure mwenza koe Akili kwangu ya nini mekweka ni wewe Imbebi kina mbalo utani fanya mini pagawe I say baby come over Mwza kumiusha ni fanya zoba Izi ya zangu meziteka so this is how to download, install, and use free vocal presets. Uh, in case you using the presets and you find out maybe it, you don't need delays, you can actually delete the delay. Or if the delay is not sounding the way you want, you can actually adjust the delay to sound the way you want. Please, in case you find this video helpful, like, subscribe, and share. See you guys.